This is why I think Pink Leaf is going to win RB battles. When you hear the word Pink Leaf, what do you think? Does Adopt Me come to mind? Does Bloxburg come to mind? No, when you hear Pink Leaf, the first thing that comes to mind is Tower of HE Double Hockey Stick. If you've been keeping up with RB battles, then you would know that Pink Leaf was gonna go against Jack Reese and TOH. Now, this was literally a guaranteed win. I mean, could you imagine Jack Reese when they told him he was gonna participate in RB battles? This is probably what happened, you know? He was just chilling, having a pretty good day. They were like, hey, you're gonna be in RB battles. And he was like, let's go, bro. And you're gonna be playing TOH. Let's go, bro. <clears throat> yeah, but your competition is Pink Leaf. Yeah, that was probably his reaction. Anyways, if you guys have seen the new video, you guys know that Pink Leaf has actually won this first challenge, okay? Up next, he has to face Tankart and Jailbreak. Now, this game is kind of obby, kind of skill. So, it could go either way. But here's the thing. Win or lose, Pink Leaf goes into, like, a redemption round, okay? I didn't realize this after a while. But there's, like, a little bracket at the bottom, okay? Four of the players eliminated <clears throat> are gonna have a chance, a chance to win and come back into the game. So let's say Pink Leaf does win. Well, he's into the finals, but if he doesn't, he's most likely going to win the redemption round because it's Mount Everest, okay? It's literally that game, pretty much like an obby game. All you do is climb that I know of. It's literally a guarantee for Pink Leaf if he were to get eliminated in jailbreak. Literally last year, Streetcraft lost to Tankar because of an obby. He lost to Tankar because of an obby. Pink Leaf is the pro of obbies. Now, keep in mind, all these videos that are being posted right now were recorded months ago, okay? Which means they most likely already know who's gonna win. And listen to what Tankar says about him and Pink Leaf going against each other in Jailbreak. Oh no, bro, this is gonna be tough. Look at this. Jailbreak, me versus Pink Leaf. Now, the problem is, Jailbreak has PvP and parkour, bro. This is gonna be the battle of the century right here, bro. It has PvP and parkour. I could lose, but I could also win. Nah, bro, I have no idea. I think I might lose. I could actually lose this. Jailbreak literally has more parkour than PvP, bro. This is gonna be the- this is gonna be the biggest battle, bro. Like, how much closer can you get? The biggest parkour sweat in the entire tournament versus the biggest PvP sweat in the entire tournament. I'm not that good at jailbreak. I literally die to the jewelry store every single time, bro. You have to jump over lasers. You have to jump on like some crazy things, bro. And I, I always die in the parkour section. You guys saw last year I died to the jewelry store because I couldn't even jump over a laser, bro. And th this game has a lot of a lot of lasers. I think I'm gonna lose, boys. I, I think I am. He sounds intimidated by Pink Leaf. Also, there's this picture that caught my attention the other day. Why does Pink Leaf have so many wins? Why is he grinding the RB Battles minigames so much if he weren't in the finals? Creecraft won first season. Oh my god. Yeah. Tinkar won second season. It's a race. It's a race. Guys, I've never even made it this far before. I win! Woo! Oh Let's go, baby! It's time for a new winner. It is time for a new winner. If you agree with me, I'd appreciate if you would drop a like on this video and subscribe. If you don't, please state down your opinions in the comments. I'd like to hear them all as to why you think someone else may win as well. Now, I could be wrong. Anyone, anyone could win this RB Battles. But that is my reasoning as to why I think Pink Leaf is going to win RB Battles Season 3. And with that being said, I hope you guys all have an excellent day.